Hey guys, my name is Vane. Darn, I was just, <laughs> just slurring my words there. Hi guys, I'm Russell Vane, and welcome back to another episode of Borderlands 3. Last episode, we were basically doing a side mission. Oh, well, actually, we finished uh, a main mission. No, darn. I started off with a side mission, helping some lady do some sort of, like, cool car tricks, basically just driving off a ramp. And then we just finished the ramp stuff and kind of ended on a sob story with the fact that, uh, sad story rather, not sob story, I don't know why, the sob story sounds more more mean than sad story. Uh, sad story of how sh her father was dead for not landing it properly. Um, so yeah, we helped her out and then we went to the main mission, turned that in to uh, Jacobs and uh, Hammerlock and we were told to go to the Jacobs mansion. So that the old man, so we can find like vault key piece inside the, or the vault key inside the old man's uh, mansion. So that's where we're at now. But we took a detour. We're doing a side mission about some witch who betrayed us uh, because, or betrayed her, her occult society thing. And we're off to kill her now because apparently she betrayed their pact with a capital P. Uh, so yeah, we're doing just that right now. And that was a checkpoint that I could have gotten earlier in the last episode, but it's fine. Uh, this is a gun we got from this from this mission anyway, so it's besides the point of what I need right now. Oh wait, what the Composition suits. It's kind of weird that they all have like a. Uh... Man, this shotgun is very like. It's not the best, is it? Let me see. He has 122, so it's a definitive damage, but it's like. Oh, leveled up. Vaulting your way to the That's top. The spirit. Out. Oh, level 25. I know, I know, game. I got vaulting your way to the top of Cuban Unlocked, is what it said. Oh, jeez. Oh, I got so much explosions happening in my ear. I can't even barely. I can barely hear anything right now. I can't even hear myself, really. Oh. Oh, he died. Cool. Ow. Is there more over there? Yes, there is. Ow! I have to destroy the pot in order to, like... Get out of here, please. Uh, yeah, I need to destroy that pot over there. That's why I still need to use this thing. There we go. What do you mean? You should be paying for your sins of betraying your pact with a capital P. Jeez, they're just spitting acid or corrosion. Woo! They're just spitting out corrosion. It's so bad. Can't even move forward because of it. Okay, there's another pot somewhere. Another, uh, another pot thing. Jeez, I see electrical shots. You're already dead. You know that, right? Oh, yeah. Where is the, the extra pot that spawns up more enemies? Alright, here we go. Time to power it up. Alright, we need to figure out where this darn pot is. There it is, there's one. Oh. Oh, there we go. I see him. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, what is that? It's insane how he just does that. Oh. There we go. Bye-bye. Yeah, go ahead. Uh-huh. I need to get rid of the enemies around here. Oh, I need shotgun ammo here, just in case. And I get extra health on top of that. Some health back. Okay, we need to find the other cauldrons. There's a few more cauldrons. I have to look at the map because I'm not looking at the mini map here for some dumb reason. No, don't you think I would just leave easily? Oh jeez! Oh, I got the guy anyways. I'm about to go down. I'm not gonna. I don't want to go down yet. Ah! Ooh. 
Man, this shotgun is hard to work with. This shotgun is really hard to work with. You ain't gonna jump me! Okay. Okay. Oh, is that the witch? It is. Azealia. I mean, she's standing in a place that really isn't great for her anyways. I'm trying to get this. And this is not a here nor there, mind you, but she always brought the worst cookies to the packs. Weekly stitching bitch. <laughs> the way he just says the packs, and then he's just saying like, oh, it's just she's just awful. <laughs> she's just an awful person. All right, let's clear this place up a little bit before we move on. Yeah, before we move on, let's clear up this enemy. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I just want to clear up the enemies here so I can just like. Pick up whatever it is and then leave. Alright, cool. Alright, let me switch this back out. I don't like this shotgun at all. Uh, yes. The shotgun, that shotgun was really bad because it wasn't doing enough damage, but it's also damaging me if I wasn't careful with how I was uh, attacking the enemies, I think. Yeah, it was a really bad gun because it was just like, it could explode in front of me, just like uh, the assault rifle when I finish off an enemy it explodes with corrosion and it affects my character as well oh i like God, your respawn. enthusiasm beast they respond oh no i'm here to turn in some mission here Wait, where is the guy oh no he's up here i'm coming in to the to turn it in now i infuse that boom brew down into this grenade mine hope you like it you uh. sure show that bitch what for i mean i mean which Wait, what did I say? Oh, hell, who cares? She dead. <laughs> I love how she, he's just like, oh, yeah, I said the other word, but not this word. <laughs> She's not a witch. Okay. Uh, oh, what? We, we're one away from just getting this thing? Seriously? All right, what is this ability, actually? Action skill augmented. Uh, action skill augments. Health regen per second. Plus 10% per kill. 20% damage, radiation damage. Oh wait, that's the uh... No, actually no, yeah, that's what that is. After using the Gamma Burst, the Rift remains for the duration of the skill. While standing near the Rift, Flak and their allies regenerate health. Oh no, I don't need that then. I was thinking that it would be nice to get that, but I'm like, hmm. I prefer these two, I guess, for the time being. So it'd be nicer that way, I guess. Uh, we still need to get some upgrades on some of these other ones, I guess. So, we'll, we'll make it, I guess, somehow. Lead or laser or whatever. Yeah. I just like how she just, like, blew up in pieces. Rest in pieces. Alright, we need to get four... So, let's go back to the main store, shall we? Yeah, we're going to the states. The Jacob's estate. Uh, so we can get him... So we can get in and, like, get whatever it is. Enemies on top. I can barely see him. Oh, jeez. Alright. Fall and be reborn to the hunt. Ow. Oh, jeez. I can't even hit him for some odd reason. There we go. You there. How are your last breaths? Alright. Oh jeez, big guys here. Wow, badass cycle. I can't see. I don't believe I've seen this. Where are you running, dude? Oh jeez. There's so much enemy. Alright, more enemies. Oh sheesh, how many enemies are there up there? Oh, 
Oh great. I'm guessing there might be an enemy behind me, but I can't tell. Oh yeah, the there is an enemy on top. Uh-huh, there's an, a re reward of some sort. I don't know what you're talking about. Ow! I saw one above. Second wind into that one. Oh no, it's a Goliath! Oh no! Yeah, I remember the Goliath from... I remember the Goliath from the previous two games. Or three, I can't remember if the pre-sequel had it. But... The Goliath is pretty, like, boy. It's a pretty strong enemy type, honestly, if you're not careful. I remember, like, the Goliath being, like, a, a pretty difficult fight before as well. So it's a really nice thing to see, the, see them return, because I thought they weren't returning due to... Due to the fact that I've kept seeing more big-looking enemies, like, bigger-looking, tougher enemies, but I was just, like, thinking, where's the Goliath? Or... I call it the Bruiser, I think, because I thought it was what it was named, but... I must say... I admire how the Calypsos convinced every illiterate piece of talking meat to worship them with blind devotion. Makes a rich bitch want a cult of her own. Perhaps when my business here is finished. You're probably not gonna get your business finished to begin with. Like, I fear that the, uh, the cultists are- or the children of the vault will probably betray her anyways. But I don't think she'll die, I think. Because I think she- I don't feel like, uh she'll die, but I think she will probably be used as a character to help Jacobs and Hammerlock in some capacity, I bet. I wouldn't be surprised, though, if she turns to the- to the- I would not be surprised if she flips to our side because of the fact that the Children of the Vault probably promises her things, but then they're not going on their words on it. It's that they'd rather just end her life and stuff, and we protect her or something like that. Because she's not doing a good job or whatever. I don't know. But see, this is also the difficult thing, is what I'm trying to say, uh, in many other episodes. It's like... <coughs> there's also probably a side quest here, side mission here later on, or something related. Time to prove my word. God world. Yes, into the fray! Yes, doggy dog world where you die. Explosion. Also, where did they come from? They look like they just teleported in. Ooh. Gimme, give gimme give good. Not that great, but that's fine, I guess. I do have some weapons in here that I did see that I picked up. Uh, oh, I actually went to the socials and grabbed whatever guns they awarded me through the mail. Um, I picked up some, but I don't think they were that great. It was like the 120 right here, I think. This is the one I picked up in the the mail from the social stuff. I think that's only... Yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay. Oh, <clears throat> pick up the wrong one. I like how dropping it just made it fly off to the edge in the back. <laughs> just like how it did that. Alright. Iridian! Uh, I mean... Let's see what you hide. Oh. Alright. Weapons! Ah, it's not that great. It's okay. It's not the best thing around, I'm seeing. It's definitely something I could just sell for sure, for decent money. Dang it. I thought it would be nice. Whatever. Alright, let's keep going. Greetings. Oh, I'm zero. zero. You will execute on these assassinations. A man, a monster. Waste no time with such quandaries. They both bleed the same. Wait, what? How did he come? Oh. He's one of those Goliaths. I'm so confused. Oh, there's another enemy up there now. Another fall silent. Uh huh. I'm very s confused that they just randomly dropped a uh, servant's lift. Okay. I'm very confused by why there was like this random bounty hunting spot thing. Wasn't sure that that it was needing that, honestly. But, hey, I guess we got through it. The place looks really nice, though, so. I'm not shooting at the right direction for some dumb reason. 
I remember the Goliath doesn't have any factions, I think. Let the hero rage. Yeah, let, let the raging Goliath hit something else, Mr. Chu. Yeah, because I remember the, the raging Goliath would do its own thing, I guess, I'd say. Oh, there's another one. Oh, jeez. Who? I like how they just flow back. Oh. Goodbye. What is this heap of trash? Oh, look at that mansion up there. That's a really cool looking mansion, nonetheless. Even though it's a little blocked by shrubberies and everything. It's whatever. Alright, we're good on time for now. Let me actually go back here a little bit and then take a picture here. It's really cool looking scenes that I that I really like. It's a really cool space to look at, man. I don't know. I'm just kind of like the screenshot type of person who just likes to screenshot everything they go by. That looks nice. It's a shame that some other games I don't like have the time to do screenshots for. Um, like a photo mode stuff earlier on was like things I just didn't do enough photo modes of. Huh? Oh. Come on down. Oh, missed it by a little bit. And missed it really bad then. Good boy. Alright. That was a weird miss. Like, I shot two times, and that was the only time I could have gotten some shot in. And I just did the crappiest job ever. I need sniper rifle ammo, please. I guess I'll use my SMG for the time being, considering I have more ammo of that than anything. Are we gonna defend the point here while waiting for the thing to come down? Looks like we might have to. I'm nearly inside the manor by way of a rather tight underground passage. Jacob's estate has more entrances than a harlot at a bordello for squids, if you don't mind a tight squeeze. Hmm. Speaking of suckers, while you distract Aurelia, I'll search the cabaret in the theater wing. My father had a study hidden underneath the stage. If there's a clue to the vault key, it'll be in there. I wouldn't be surprised. This thing moves a lot faster when it when we're riding it. It moves a lot slower when we're waiting for it, which is funnier to me. I'm in. It rustles my jackboots to see that harp it chilling my ancestral halls. My family's portraits were thrown out into the gully with no more pomp than a spent sheep gut. But I wouldn't give to introduce her to the business end of my shotgun. Mm. But I mean, it's Hammerlock's sister, you know. I bet Hammerlock wouldn't want to just kill her right outright when the opportunity comes. I don't feel like he would. Not that I want to see what's over here first before we move forward. Oh, this is that spot that we that we were over there earlier, and then <laughs> we never got to the second part of the platform because it was not necessary there yet. Maybe we'll come back to it if there's a side mission or if I want to hunt for some loot, I guess. I guess I'm the type of person who would go for it for loot, but I'll probably hold off from it, I guess. I really want to spend more time in the levels just to see what I can get from it, but... As I'm heading to the estate one day, I hear somebody shooting and cursing. So I go around the corner and find this boy Wainwright, pistol in hand, trying to shoot cans off a fence. <laughs> I ain't no gunslinger, but the kid, he was a terrible shot. Squinting <laughs> and licking his lips and cursing and saying he'd never be a Jacobs. Oof. Then I figure out why. Kid's blind in one eye. Mm. So I come up to him and say, hey kid, try a shotgun. Mm. Excuse me, I was still drinking my water when that happened, when the finished audio happened. I could crack you open. I thought it was going to be a little longer in the conversation, but it's fine. Anyways, um, yeah, that's really cool origin storytelling. I actually like these Typhons a little, I like the, not a little bit, I like the Typhons a lot for its storytelling purposes, but I hate that it's stationary and not an Echo Piece, like they, like the other Echo Pieces we find all, out, out in the, out in the wilds. I still much prefer it where it doesn't force us to stay in that spot to listen to it. Um, but I guess that's what it is. Is there anything in the back here? 
Any boxes of loot or iridian stones or something? No. All right, let's get inside the mansion, I guess, or the estate, rather. Manor. Oh man, actually, come here, Mr. Shu. I need to uh, to not be in the Photoshop that <laughs> randomly here. All right, photo mode. Honestly, just leave the photo mode at first person. I I guess I'd say. There we are. This is just the screenshotting, not for the thumbnail. I think the thumbnail will be something, something else. We'll see. I'm not too sure yet. I'm a little bit concerned that I don't have a thumbnail for this video yet because of how little cutscenes have actually shown up or actual potential cutscenes that have shown up. This house looks a little complex though at the same time. Like it has like some small nook and cranny somewhere around here. Ammo before we go in. That's a really cool music box ammo gift thing. That's really cool. Ammo? No? We're good, I think. Okay. Open sesame! Oh, okay. Right on time, Vault Hunter. Please do come in. Enemies, let's go! That woman can make even proper hospitality sound sinister. But go along with whatever she says while I search the cabaret. Uh huh. I'll be with you in just a moment. Wait for me in the dining hall and we'll discuss your payment. Hall. Hole. What 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 did she what is she meant by hole? I wanted to get that blue so I could uh, sell it off. What is this? It says fatal error. I think it says. I could barely read it. Shut up. Welcoming center. Oh, we can sell stuff here too. Are we going into a boss fight? Oh my god, I can't believe they actually have that. <laughs> have her own picture there. Oh, I like that they both play at a similar time frame. <laughs> da -da 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 oh, an echo. Hey, echo. So, Clayton, you wish to speak to me? Clay's fine. Old oh. Money just got a generous offer on the Jacobs Corporation. He turned it down, of course, but I thought you'd want to know it came from one Aurelia Hammerlock. I assure you she cares little for Jacobs itself. This is about me. Figured out that much myself. But your sister doesn't strike me as a type to let things lie. You know her, Alistair. Is this the end or the beginning? The lizard. Afraid you lost me there. <laughs> Once, when we were children, my sister and I found an extremely rare lizard in the woods near our home. A magnificent specimen. Aurelia wanted to keep it as a pet, but my sister has never been one for cultivating life, shall we say. I nurtured it in secret, despite her insisting the lizard was hers. I labored to build it a proper habitat. Natural flora, the right balance of water and sunlight, ample food, of course. But one day I returned to find the lizard dead. What? The water level was too high. Oh. There were scratch marks on the glass, where it had clawed madly for air. And you blamed yourself? I did, at the time. Only later did I realize what my sister had done. She had left a block of ice in the habitat to slowly melt, forcing the lizard to scramble ever higher until it was too late. Had she simply wanted to kill it, she could have done so. But that's not her way. Aurelia wanted me to believe that I was to blame. Oh. Well, luckily we ain't lizards. An astute observation. But now, as I look around, I wonder how long the waters have been rising. Oh, interesting. I like that his observation of his sister. I actually like this dynamic about. Diagnosis? Go see a real doctor. Need healing? Come see me. <laughs> like I like I that he analyzes Aurelia in a way that helps us kind of as players to to, to kind of dive into her character, I guess. And I think that's a nice touch for having the Echo be like in those positions of I like. Put it to good use. In those positions of like trying to see what she's all about, kind of thing. 282? No. Yeah, I forgot that was not great enough. Yeah, some good cells here. Uh, grenade mod doesn't have enough damage. I gotta sell it because I wanna keep purple mods only. I only keep purple class mods. But not blue. Oh. 
There was like a, there was a little bug where they just they they the UI was showing the wrong thing. <laughs> kind of confused by it. Yeah, it's kind of cool that they show a little bit or talk a little bit about Aurelia, based on her like, uh, based on her. Wait, what time is it? Two o two, two o three. Darn, this clock reflecting the real time that's happening here in my playthrough would have been great, but I don't think that they have the capabilities because that would have required looking into your system, but then again, I don't know. I don't think this game is an online, always online type of game, so that's what I'm thankful for. I'm very thankful that the game is not requiring you to be online all the time to play this, I think. So if, if systems or servers are offline, it wouldn't be too bad. Also, there's a lot of these weird digital pads. I'm wondering if these things actually have like a secret something going on that we haven't spotted yet. All right, this place looks slightly creepy based on how things are going so far. More ammo money. Just grabbing all the money that I can right now. Oh, I see the magic something there. Let me check this area out for any loot that I might need. No. Loot indeed. Damn it. Nothing great. Again. It's nothing great. Let me go and sell the thing first, and then we'll open up that pathway here. Uh, Down we go. Down we go. Let me also take a picture of... Uh, Uh huh. Yeah, let's take a picture of that. That portrait up here. I, I realize I think the portrait would be a nice touch if we don't have a thumbnail. But I think we're gonna get into a boss fight anyways, I think. So we'll probably maybe be fine without having to do this as a thumbnail. But we'll see. There we go. Yeah, that'll be my temporary thumbnail if there is no thumbnail to begin with. She looks pretty good, actually. She looks like a pretty good like character design. Though I think Aurelia did show up for the pre-sequel, I think. Uh, because I think that I remember seeing the game with a DLC about the, the queen, the ice queen or something like that. I can't remember exactly what it was. Uh, because I think we've seen Aurelia, but I just don't remember too fondly of who she was as, as a character yet. But I might be wrong. Let's go. Oh, there's a guy. Okay, cool. Oh, Children of the Vault tricked us into this. Holy me! You should see the look on your stupid face. A vault thief, as promised. Not bad, uh, Baroness. But you still owe us a vault key. She's still looking. I am working on it as we speak. Well, I will leave you to your fun. Good doing business with you, Vault Hunter. Can we finally kill this guy for once? This is awesome. We haven't really had a chance to get to know each other, huh? And Ty's been doing most of the talking. Yeah? She does that, right? She's the center of the galaxy, and the rest of us just sort of orbit around her. But things are changing. Freaking look at me! I I've never felt this good in my life! Whoa! What is this? What is this? Your siren friend? She didn't know what she had. With this power, I can pull the stars out of the goddamn sky. You know, Tyreen says we should let you keep playing along. Yeah, a little competition gets our followers all riled up. Uh-huh. But I'm not one of them. No, not anymore. And I'm done getting table scraps. Fill your hands, you zealot scum! Jacob, huh? careful! Oh! Time to fight him. Oh, I'm gonna kill you! We Come gotta fight this guy. Me, you rat -faced Oops. Bastard. Misclicked. <laughs> I wanted to, to get rid of this guy. No, Jacobs, no! Dude, don't! Ugh. Damn it. No plan. You search the cabaret. I'll what? keep this punk ass rat boy running around like a jabber with its bum hole on fire. There we go. There's the other enemies. Oh. I would love to search it while we were doing this, but. Damn it, Jacob. Should have let me handle it. Excellent kill, boy. Wait, he didn't kill anybody. I did. Oh, there's a shotgun tank. Whew. Anything else? Anyone else? 
Want a piece of my bullets? Oh, I hope Jacob is not dead. He went up. He was up here, right? They might have went into some like loca location somewhere nearby, but I don't know. We couldn't. I couldn't tell, anyways. Unfortunately. All right, I'm gonna go this way here. Yep. Oh. Getting away. Children of the vault. Wake your empty heads up and start shooting. Kill the vault hunter. Well, the buddies are not gonna be always living. All right, let me see if I can grab this side quest, side mission here as well. I need to find out where the side mission is. Oh, it's in there. Okay, let me go grab these things first. I'm wondering what the side mission is. Really, it's kind of weird to me. Oh, jeez. Who's this? Who are you? Socked. Or... Sacked. Sorry, he sucked. I thought that was an O, but it's an A. <laughs> this body was hiding in a closet. Wainwright, did you know this man? Why, that's Aldrin, our family butler. He knew where all the bodies were buried, and now it seems he's joined them. My father always suspected him of recording their conversations. See if he managed to capture his own untimely hand. I mean, he probably most likely did. I mean, if he's recording every single thing in this household... Kind of feels like he would probably record everything up to his death anyways as well. Is this echo in here? Oh, no, we had to find it elsewhere, I think, right? Where did he hide this thingy my bubber? Alright, let me let me track this a little bit. I wanna still pick it up at least. I mean it's inside this house, I bet. Uh Oh. That was a thing? I couldn't tell that was a thing. I didn't know that was a thing we could use. It's locked, but I don't think that was it. Somewhere around this area, it seems. Uh, did I just see it? No, I thought it was in the... <laughs> I thought it was in, like, between the... The pillars here. That was my bad. I was not reading. I couldn't see it really. Is it here? I guess under the under the seats, the love cushions. Under these seats down here, maybe. No. I don't think these are. Uh. No, it's not here. Oh, this is a button. Ah. That statue was wearing a wire. Appears that it was transmitting its recordings to the safe nearby. It'll be triple locked, so find the three catches to open it up. Okay, so this is one of them, apparently. What is this? That is a really weirdly specific looking lock. <laughs> a locker, rather. Alright, we need to find more headpieces, I guess. This is really cool. It's kind of like a weird puzzly sort of thing. Well, that's interesting. Oh. I like how we can just hit it anyways without shooting at it. Uh. Getting health, which is nice. There's a headpiece out here, wasn't it? Oh, we're out of time too. Oof. Uh, give me a second. Let me finish this headpiece searching here. There should be a headpiece somewhere out here, right? Yeah, because I kind of... I kind of felt like there would be something out here. It wouldn't be inside all the time. No, no. Oh, there you are. And... There we are. Open sesame! I don't know why I keep saying open sesame nowadays. Echo log. Oh. Now, before I fire you, tell me, where did Montgomery Jacobs hide the vault key? I haven't the faintest clue what you mean, Baroness. I've served four generations in Jacobs Manor with dignity and honor, and I intend to stay right here. Unless you want it going public that you've gotten into bed with... <laughs> uh, gone to bed with? 
was still a loyal servant in his own way. If he did have blackmail against Aurelia, he'd have given it to the other staff for safekeeping. Mm. Look in the servants' quarters. All right. Yeah, it seems like we're gonna probably have some more information about other things. Ah, uh, darn! I don't have a save point around here. The checkpoint is the the closest checkpoint was technically the the main room, the the welcoming room. I guess it's what they called it. Let me move a little bit deeper to, find see, beast. to see if there's anything. Ooh. Oh, but it's a blue that's not to a gun I want. This Say, rat boy, aren't you the one who has to suck at your sister's teeth for sustenance? Ew. Die in a gutter. <laughs> Love how he's just like teasing him, making fun of him. There is a, a door behind it to a safe point, it looks like. Okay, we're good here, I think. Hopefully not pursuing anything further at the moment. Uh, ooh, some loot. I'll take it. Oh, please, shut up. Uh, eh, nothing good there, unfortunately. Alright, cool. Um, I don't think I can re-save right here, but it's fine. This will be where we'll stop here for now. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next episode. Or nobody mind. And hope you guys got a great, amazing day, weekend, night, or whenever you're watching this coming up for you. Hopefully you got them. Uh, and otherwise, yeah, I'm gonna continue with the series and, and enjoy my time with <laughs> trying to chase after both uh, the servant that left his message behind uh, about Aurelia's secrets to also uh, helping out <laughs> Jacobs with uh, helping out Jacobs with his problem dealing with Ty Tyrese Tyrone whatever crap his name is <laughs> the other half of the children of the vault siblings uh, the Calypso to siblings whatever crap uh, before I go also uh, since we we're a little bit longer or stretched for time a little bit but um, I have heard about the Borderlands movie this is like what like three weeks since it's released or something like that I don't know when this video goes up uh, or how long it will take before this video goes up but it should be like about two three weeks from from whenever it was released in the theaters or something um, yeah I uh, don't again I've, I mentioned it at the beginning of the game I think at the beginning of the series that I'm probably not gonna watch it and or I most likely won't watch it because I just don't have the time to usually sit and watch the whole movie all the way through due to my, my patience running a little thin so I like to have the highlights. Uh, but in the case of what I've heard, it seems like it's doing really not so great. Uh, if you guys want to share what your thoughts are here, that's totally fair too. Uh, I don't mind having a little thread in this comments for this episode to talk about it. Honestly, I'm not too surprised of what's going on with it. I, I'm, I just hope that the people who helped fund it the the production studios don't go under for it or whatever uh so hopefully they don't get hurt too badly i mean it's just a mistake to try to to assume that it would make a lot but i don't know i mean there's a lot of uh, mixture of like video game movies just not doing so well but that's usually a hard it's a really hard thing to pull off i think when it comes to successful ones versus non-successful ones so it, it's really hard to pull off i would say in the nature of like how the mediums are very different in games and, and movies, but that, that could be a whole conversation topic at another day for me personally on another episode or another something else entirely situation. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode anyways. And uh, yeah, Roz, 